There's a dance studio on the northeast side of Indianapolis with a pretty unique name. It's called Phoenix Rising Dance Studio. And behind that name is a story of a man who says you can rise above whatever happens to you. In this week's Inspiring Indiana, he tells our Sarah Jones he fell in love with all forms of dance after taking ballet in college. Phoenix Rising Dance Studio is more than just a name because the owner of this Indianapolis dance studio personifies it. Intrinsically aware of every muscle and every fiber in his body. Oh, I'm ready to talk about that. Choreographing his movements with purpose and elegance is how Justin Sears Watson has risen from the ashes of his past to become a professional dancer, choreographer, and owner of a dance studio. My youngest brother on the phone after he had murdered his wife and another man and then decided to kill himself. And um, I had the had a conversation with him before he took his life. Had it not been for me being able to translate that experience into a work of art that allowed me to release the guilt, the shame, the sadness, and the grief, and I would have drowned in, in that grief processing the pain through movement. I have to get this out of me because I don't have the words. Allowed him to continue to rise. And a way to really release and move past anything that would hinder me from continuing through and becoming my most powerful self. Growing up in foster care from age 10 to 18. So arts has completely changed my life and been like this constant in my life. Justin says in his life before foster care, he saw addiction and survived physical abuse, homelessness, and bullying from his peers. Going days without eating, not having running water. He says the power of art helped him to use his past to empower himself. And as a professional dancer and choreographer, that release has a ripple effect on audiences. Whether it's delicate and tender, or whether it's angry and it's heavy and it's loaded and it's grounded, everyone can see, feel, hear, taste, touch in some way those things that are, that are happening. He says performance arts can serve as a reminder that we're all just souls having a human experience. Especially in a time like this where there's so much separateness and so much division. It's the arts, it's dance, it's music that you know helps us realize that we are just all human. Art has allowed him to embrace life at its truest potential. And by sharing his gift, he hopes to inspire others to do the same. Mm.